just did five minutes on the treadmill. Come and say something real quick. Two minutes, that's my max. That's what I'm gonna do, two to three minutes. All right, so this is the second part. This is second part to understanding you, and this is understanding your personality. So I really started to dig into this just last year. I knew about this for, since 2017, it's 2022. So I knew about, knew about this about five years, but I really started to understand it just last year. And I really studied it, I've been studying it last year, this year, right? So this is how you really get to know your, under, your your personality. It's called the DISC assessment or DISC profile, whatever one you want to choose. And it's an acronym. It stands for D for dominant, I. I don't remember exactly the words, forgive me, but I know what it's about. It's like your I is like your socialness, like how sociable are you, how friendly you are. The S is how patient you are with other people, your, your, your love, your, like your caring for people. And then C, conscientiousness, I know that one. Your conscientiousness is how much structure you need, all right? So what I realized is whenever I started to see this, it's like I was really starting to see myself in the mirror and I started to understand, okay, this is why I do certain things. This is why I function this way or that way. All right, so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be straightforward with you. I'm gonna show my disc assessment either here, here, one of those. Right, my D, my dominance is very low. That's like being direct and assertive with people. Those who know me, who really know me, that's a little tough for me. I'm working on that person, and I'm gonna add this in there. I used to think that if you wanted to be like the, the best CEO, the best CEOs in the world were like the, the shark people, the type A's. The sharks, the, the people who be direct and tell you anything to your face to get stuff done. But then I realized not all CEOs are like that. You can be have a, a high S, be very uh, caring for people and be a great CEO. So when I realized that, I was like, okay, bet. So I can be my true self and be successful. So I started to study this. Now, my deep, like I said, the dominance area, I am growing in that area. Um, because I, there's some areas that I want to be, get better in. So I'm flexing that muscle, doing things to flex that muscle. The eye, my eye is in the 80s. I'm very social, very, very social. Um, so that's, that's another part. The S, S, I'm like in the 60s, the 60s area. And this is just, like I said, my caring for people. This is why I'm in front of you. This is why I want to see you do better and grow better. And last C, my conscientious. This was a game changer for me. This helped me understand that your boy needs structure. I need like routine. I've noticed that I'm my best whenever I have a routine. I'll do something at the same time, the same way, every single time. And if I want to get really get stuff done and it's over a longer period of time, I, I gotta have that routine. Or it's better if I have the routine. Now, because your boy got a baby, I'm working on not having to depend on having a routine so much, but that's what I am. But that's that's really what it is. You want to get this disc assessment. You want to take the test. You use many free ones, but the one that I suggest is Eric Thomas, the flight assessment. Go to flightassessment.com. Yes, that does cost money, but it will give you a full line of everything. There are some free ones out there. Blah, blah, blah. But learn your personality. You want to be able to see yourself. Look, It's like looking yourself in the mirror and you're like, oh, okay, that's why I do that. That's why I do that. And if you want to get better in some areas, all you have to do is just flex those muscles a little bit and you'll eventually get better for it. Get better in it. All right, I'm about to do another workout. Uh, I'm gonna do the punch pad. We're gonna do that for a little bit. And then the last one, I'm gonna ride the bike. So I'm gonna try to record, ride the bike, that whole thing.